time for a cat quest. So, all of you heard from now is that this was prior to like a couple weeks, several weeks ago or months ago. But, um, this was really cool and intriguing. So, Disney's Haunted Mansion in Disneyland is getting a major update. And, um, which is really cool for expansion. And, um, from seeing it, what it's going to look like, I've seen pictures of it and stuff online, which is actually pretty cool overall to it. But first, I want to show you, so, like, from the beginning of time, the Haunted Mansion ride used to start out with, like, you first walk in and you see, like, just grass and, like, stone hedges and just everything to it on there, which is pretty cool and everything nice to it. But when you get to, like, the other side of that corner edge, it's just, like, it's not as intriguing as the one you see in Walt Disney World. But this is when you turn around and before you almost go in back to the front. And it's just like a zigzag, zigzag pace. But, um, it's, I gotta say, I'm, think, I'm kind of happy they're doing this because Honda Mansion is kind of needs an upgrade for their line. And just from seeing the concept art of what it's going to look like, it's going to be super beautiful and unique. And just seeing all the cool, fun, like, stuff from, like, the flower edge and everything from this photo that you see here. Which is pretty cool detail that I'm seeing from my point of, point of view, too, as well. And the second one is actually pretty cool overall to it. Mona Odie's... It's, like, the gift shop. So, the gift shop, it's an all-no retail shop, which is actually pretty cool overall to it. It's almost going to be like the one in Disney World, which I did not know that they had one in Disney World. And um, it's pretty cool that we're getting it on the other side of the coast in California now, where I live. And um, it's actually pretty cool overall to it. And um, it's behind the walls of the Haunted Mansion with an all-new retail shop. So, from looking at the picture here, it's when you go out of the exit the shop is going to be right there which is such a really cool fun detail all around to it and my opinion overall to it on there but just a really cool fun little detail and features from the other cool run for Disneyland Haunted Mansion invention so that will take place in 2024 so that means after the holidays it will begin on Disney Resort in 2024. The build of the store of in the, in the Haunted Mansion will now new grounds of the Amazon guest that seems to turn the walls into new retail shop in addition next to the attractions exit, which I was correct on that too as well. But that is just all my take on the Haunted Mansion expansion, which is going to be really cool. Cannot wait to see this. And... I cannot wait to see what's in store from the Haunted Mansion ride from there and see all the new layouts that they're going to do for the line outside the, before you go into the actual ride itself, which is pretty cool to it on there. Now, this was in Disney's California Adventure, which is the Beast Library. This attraction is bond to my heart because this is such a great attraction overall to it. And it's an interactive characters with Lumiere and Cosworth and... It's your personality characters is much like you. And um, this attraction is such a great experience and all that. I'm actually afraid to say that it's gonna, I'm definitely going to miss the attraction when it leaves. On, on December 10th, 2023. Which is kind of sad to say that for my best point of view to on there as well. As, and um, just everything that was from the beginning point on to there. So... Beast's Library was opening date was 2001, along with California Adventure, and also with the dumb thing too as well, Ursula's Grotto is, unfortunately, I thought there was going to be something really cool and something coming up out as well, but no, it's just a store shed, so I'm um, like, that's kind of lame and like, what, you could do so many things in there, but overall, but, but I did hear from this point of view from other people, from online sources, that 
the Blue Sky Cellar, which is near this restaurant in California Major, across from Cars Land. That actually will be taking over that spot in the Beast Library. So, and then the Blue Sky Cellar will be turning it into the club, whatever that is called, the um, Adventures Club. D the Adventures D, the whatever that club's from Disney, the Vacation Club spot. Which is going to be really cool because going, I remember seeing all that cool stuff in the Blue Sky Cellar, so Blue Sky Cellar was just pretty cool in my opinion overall to it. And just seeing how sad it's going to be from seeing this attraction going away, but from my point of view, the Beast Library was actually one of my all-time fun thing to do. And it like, it's, it's a great attraction because with Beast Library, you can definitely like relax away from the crowds and stuff, which is kind of cool and everything to it, and and just dumb um, everything that you see on there on um, my spectacle from you on the enchantments on there to that too as well. And so the I will well actually I will mention this I will be I will be doing a video on the 9th of December before the last day, before it closes. So expect me, I will be doing it on that day. And leave in the comments down below if you want me to do both a good guy and a villain for the guys. Because if you do, I would be kind of cool if I did on that for Beast's Library. And uh, just everything to it on you see from there. And uh, it's kind of sad seeing it go and like, I will miss this attraction from heart. And like, that's what's taking over the new area of Beast Library is Blue Sky Studios too as well. So hope you guys like this fun information news video to you guys out there and um and um just all the cool pictures that you've seen from the photos on there too as well. Subscribe to my channel, leave a notification on if I'm posting any videos. Leave the comments down below and see you guys next time only on CapQuest.